Hey, Ivana. So I have your messages here in regard to the reading that you wanted. And so um, I will let you know that I am going to do your reading for you now, obviously. So thank you so much for booking with me. Uh, but going forward, I did actually change my booking procedures and price. So moving forward, please use the um, link in my bio just to book. Uh, especially when it comes down to video messages because it's still a video message. It is actually still $25. I'm going to change the price now and uh, you'll get your reading guaranteed within seven days. So be aware of that. I am on Cameo for uh, booking going forward. Anywho, so um, I see here that you want us to know what good things are coming for you in 2024. And then your next question is, Will I, will I accomplish my financial goals by 2025? So thank you. And you know, you, you thank me. So thank you for booking, of course, again. I, I feel compelled to use these cards, but I will say this. I'm using these cards and they don't, they're not necessarily um, the best deck for you. Uh, I will say this also. I'm picking up an energy more or less that this isn't really about a reading for you. I feel like what I'm really getting is that it's time for you to spread your wings and fly and move away from uh, this idea of doubt. Like, I feel like there's a lot of doubt inside of you. You know what's coming towards you. I feel like there's uh, a guarantee of some sort that, that you are prepared for, but it's not coming on your timeline. And so it's causing like, you know, delays in your situation because of impatience. And so let's just see. One of the good things that may be coming in for you is some type of partnership and or relationship. So be aware of that. I'll get more details about that in a second. But I will say this also, when you go into relationship, especially if it's like one of those uh, spiritual unions for a good reason, there will be a lot of conflict. So yeah, a good thing coming in for you is probably a, a relationship of some sort whether it be business or romantic, which again, business or romantic, it could turn into both. Uh, just because it's coming in for you doesn't mean it's going to be like the easiest thing. <laughs> okay. Like, um, I'm picking up like an energy of what good things are coming in for you. I feel like what you need to recognize is that the best that you're going to feel is in this moment. So change your mindset about what it is that you're going through. Like, are you happy and healthy? Do you have food in the house? Like it's time for you to start looking at things from the, from the perspective that what you want to be a good thing is what you are like receiving in this moment. And so that's like the truth of the matter. Like once you change your internal dialogue, the things that you're seeing around you is going to change anyway. But I do feel like, again, there's some type of partnership coming to you. Uh, this person, I feel like it's this person, but it could also be you. But it, honestly, it feels like this person. There could be some type of resistance or, um, or, or is, I keep picking up like resistance or being pushed away. So this person may push you away, but the pushing away is like a lesson for you. It's a lesson, a lesson in patience and also a lesson, a lesson in like weighing out your options. This, cause again, this could be like a business too. Don't think it's just about relationship. Uh, but I feel like the problem that you're kind of like running into is that the things that you want to have happen aren't going anywhere, but all this other stuff <laughs> that spirit is trying to use to get your attention, all of that's going to where you need it to go to. But just because it's one spot is not moving is causing you so much stagnation. And so you need to like, think about things a little bit more open-minded, uh, a little bit more open-mindedly open-minded, but also being open mindful and mindfulness is more like meditation and knowing where you are in this present moment. And so like, okay, so because I, I, I feel like you're one of those people or you're going through a phase where you're becoming one of those people where uh, once you find this one thing and it makes you happy, you're still, you're going to stick with that instead of still weighing out multiple different options. Like you never know if it's, a, if it's the best thing for you until you like date around and see what else is out there. And so that's about love, but also that's could be like your relate your business relationships too. But I think that one of the things that's really hindering you right now is that the love situation that you are, um, desiring isn't really what's manifesting for you. But I do feel like you're coming out of like whatever this, uh, this energy of doubt is. So that's a good thing for 2024. And then, uh, will you accomplish? I feel like, no, your, <laughs> your second question, I feel like is a no. 
I just feel like it's a no, but be aware that this is something that you need to kind of like um, think about in your own terms also. Because yeah, I feel like it's a no, but that doesn't mean that you won't get to where you are comfortably, you know, financial in finances or whatever. This more or less feels like, um, like your goals always changing, kind of changing your mind all the time, kind of up and down or whatever. Like this is the idea that this is the idea that you got that you got to be a little bit more patient in what it is that you're looking forward to in business, love, life, um, in all of this. I'm feeling like it's, it's a bigger journey than what you're anticipating in terms of like, um, in, in terms of what's like coming into fruition in front of you. But it doesn't mean that you're not on your, on the right path or it doesn't mean that you're not getting there. Right now, I feel like your biggest thing right now is patience. And so I'm gonna leave it at that. I really hope that you enjoyed that. And again, going forward, it's going to be, uh, I need to be booked on, I need to be booked on Cameo. Listen to me. <laughs> going forward, please book on Cameo, the link in my bio. Um, so yeah, thank you so much again and blessings to you.